filter. We're going to do it all. So let's start this shit off the right way, man. I don't know what the fuck is going on in the world right now. But for the Migos. It's wild out here. For the Migos. Let me tell you something. For them to break, break up. Mm. And for Quavo and Takeoff to drop this album. Neff and Few. Neff and Few. For them to drop this album. They didn't, they didn't hit the world with a crazy one today, man. Mm. Everybody going crazy right now. You feel me? What do you do, man? I, hey, Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. They, they insinuated. Did he do a, uh, he did the baby move? They, they insinuating. All these rappers uh, pillow talking? Bro, they, <laughs> what he's insinuating, the internet is going crazy right now. They trying to figure it out. They trying to figure it out. It's out of one. It's out of one or two, huh? It's out of one or two. Now, one of them men is married. First, so break it. First, I, break it down. What happened? Let the people know what we are talking about. I, I can we even play the song on caffeine? We, we can play the clip, huh? We ain't gotta play the clip. You can just tell them what happened. Well, I want to hear the clip. That's why. That's what they said. Hold on. Let me. Let me be. Let's be. Let me be. Uh. Let me make sure I'm doing my due diligence. You know what I'm saying? Let me make sure I'm doing my due diligence. Hold up. We're going to play a little clip of this motherfucker, what the nigga said. It's wild right now, man. Hold up. All right. Here we go. Wait a minute. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Back, but I ain't not at all. You wanted the game, you should have just said it. We would have blessed it. Should have just said it. Now shit got messed. Hold on. I said, Carisha, please. Cause she too messy. Please. Bitch, fuck my dog behind my back, but I ain't stressing. Not at all. You wanted the game, you should have just said it. We would have blessed it. Should have just said it. Now shit got messy. Oh. Mm. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Uh oh. Now, just by him saying that, oh, and we hit that 1K. One Shout K, out to one K. K. Let's get the fifteen hundred into that two K. Man, listen. Just by him saying that, that's not enough evidence for me to think my boy Offset. You know what I'm saying? Stepped out on Cardi B. You think he meant Offset? Niggas is trying to put this on Offset right now. I mean, but we had it was pictures that appeared with somebody else. Yeah, but I'm saying. Why would y'all put that on the man that's married right now? Because they ain't talking. Because they ain't talking right now. And then y'all assuming that this is the reason why, you know what I'm saying, the shit is breaking up. Now, the other motherfucker. The other motherfucker. The other motherfucker, you know, they, you know what I'm saying? They got pictures and shit like that. So that'll make sitting, more sitting sense. Sitting on his lap. Sitting on his lap. Shopping. Shopping. That makes sense. That makes most sense. I doubt, I doubt my man's went and knocked down his homeboys. Hey, but but look, but look, the thing is, is when he say she hit his man's, he said, I she, don't... He said she hit the gang. It's QC. Okay, okay, you right. I thought he said his man's. He said she hit the gang. You want to be part of but the But he gang? said you want to... Okay, okay, you right, you right. You right. You 100% right. I definitely doubt, I definitely doubt it was offset. I would say they, you know, you know, Cardi B, would, him, Cardi B would have came out today tripping. True, I would say they cold to put that on that nigga. Yeah. But this it's even more fucked up because I just seen the fucking um the shit with Sweetie when she was talking to uh uh young Miami and she was saying how she thought they laughed they laughed at her didn't they Quavo was the one and all that shit saying she th so I'm like come on man if this is true. Shame, 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 shame. Messy, huh? Big ball of mess. Big man. ball of mess. Sheesh. Come on, man. Big ball of mess. This is that, that's crazy. But I ain't gonna lie. That's gonna make a nigga turn into tune into this album. That's crazy. They didn't hit him with one. What do you think about uh these rappers putting these girls on blast, man? We just had the baby do it with Meg, and now we got bruh doing it with Sweetie. I ain't gonna lie. This is a little different. It's a little more, this is in-house. You know what I'm saying? But still, what you think about them airing out females like these other rappers? In this situation. Like we would we would expect it to be vice versa, like the girls airing out the guys, but. If I ain't doing it. Mm -mm. That's crazy. Nah. 
You think that's gonna become a trend? Yeah, it's gonna become a trend. All the male rappers gonna be niggas gonna be doing that shit. Damn. I mean, look, look at the time we in right now. Nigga, want okay? Look, I I can un, I can understand it. It's still fucked up, but I can understand it from the baby's point because he want to sell the motherfucking albums. You feel me? You see, they fucking blackballing this nigga or whatever the fuck they doing. He 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 probably thinking I gotta do what the fuck I what I gotta do. They him and Meg ain't on good terms supposedly, so he threw that shit out there. This is another situation like that. You feel me? Quavo and uh, uh, Takeoff, nigga, they album about to drop. Nigga, this is about, this is everywhere. They getting all the press right now. Damn. But I I, I want to see what Sweetie going to say about this shit. Song actually sounds good, too. It's on fire. I ain't going to lie. The shit I've been hearing from them, too, so far, I'm fucking with it. I'm fucking with it. Yeah, I'm fucking with it. Now, I'm going to keep it gangster. I'm going to keep it all the way gangster. I ain't think I wasn't too excited for the album because I didn't know what it was going to sound like. That first single, it ain't really catch me. Everything else they've been doing, I've been rocking with that shit. This shit right now, I'm going to listen to the album for sure. Yeah, I'm going to fuck with the album. I'm going to fuck with the album. I want to hear what the fuck niggas are talking about. You feel me? Them niggas hard, man. I wish they could uh, get that shit together and, you know, form back up. Oh, the, for sure. The trio. But they they holding down with just them two. I ain't gonna lie. They is. Fuck with it. Still got bangers. Offset doing this thing on the solo though. That's I, what I'm saying. I, I mean, what they what they should do? Well, I can't say it because we don't know the back back situation of it. I'm gonna say they should drop the same day. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? You want to compete with each other? Not compete. I'm just saying. After that, nigga. Join back together, drop Amigos album. Niggas, that go crazy right now to happen. Like, nah, nigga, we 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 dropped our solo shit that we got back together and then dropped the whole album. Me personally, I want to see the Amigos as a trio. I understand if it can't be, you know what I'm saying, reconciled, but that's me personally. What about you? Yeah, hell yeah. I like yeah. them niggas as a trio. I hate... I would like to see them niggas work with Lil Baby, but, you know. For sure. But I hate when groups that are so good together break up. Because they, they still sound good, though. No, they stand, They sound good. Don't get me wrong. Pretty Ricky, my, my nigga, dropped two fucking amazing R&B albums, man. You know what I'm saying? Amazing R&B albums. And then, you know, Pleasure Leave. Shit was still cool. <laughs> Pleasure was doing his thing. Pleasure was right on the songs. But I'm saying, it's Pleasure was doing his shit. He had some records, but it still wasn't them first two classic albums. You feel me? Uh, Who was the... Okay, let me ask you this. Who out of any group... Beyonce. That don't even count. Why well, don't? That don't even count. She left the group and became massive. She did? That's the question you was going to ask, right? She did. All right, who else? <laughs> Shit. From a group that spun off? That spun off? Justin Timberlake. Justin Timberlake. Okay. Okay, let's say rap. That was in a rap group? In a rap group. How far back we going? In the, it don't matter. Hmm. Ice Cube. But they all did their shit. Ice Cube spun off and did his thing. Killed it. Okay, okay. Bobby Brown spun off from New Edition and did his thing. This is, this is true. This is true. Uh, Shit, who else? Uh, Lil Wayne spun off from the Hot Boys, did his thing. This is true. It's a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? Uh, shit. Who else would you say? I would say even like on some like Corrupt, when he, when he did a solo ah, thing. Ah, they said Omarion. Omarion. Corrupt did a solo thing and, went, and got cracking. Corrupt got cracking. Yeah, Omarion for sure. Omarion got on. Shit, Marcus Houston. Yeah, we talking about Omarion. He did. He, he did. Who else was in the group? Method Man, Fifty Cent. Okay, they're going. Tupac. Yeah. Yeah. Tupac. What's he in? Uh, My, oh, the, the biggest of all time, Michael Jackson. That nigga left Jackson. his brothers. Y'all gotta go. <laughs> he left his blood. That nigga said, "Y'all can't keep up." He left go. his blood and went crazy. He was popping with his brothers. Left his brothers. Y'all gotta go. And became top of the fucking world. Y'all gotta go. 
Y'all gotta go. Facts. Like, who could keep up with Michael Jackson out of his brothers, bro? Nobody. Nobody. Janet, though. Oh, Janet did her shit. Janet, Janet did her shit. He held it down. Jada kissed from the locks. Jada, for sure, for sure. Yeah, you know I mean, for sure. Jada. It's so it is. It is. It is. A lot of motherfuckers that left and popped off. It is. That's crazy though. A lot of motherfuckers that left and popped off. Damn. Who, as of recent, in the last ten years, there ain't really been no groups in the last oh, ten Jeezy. years like that. Oh, Jeezy. Yeah. I mean, yeah. He left Shoreline. Oh, Sob and uh. Oh, uh, Sob. Uh, I'm saying Sob and uh. That was like the only groups. What other groups was? Oh, Travis Porter, but they didn't break off. Travis Porter was a group, but they didn't break off though. Travis Porter, who else? Who else? Who else was a group? I don't understand the group shit though. Nigga, hey, that money got to split. Push a T? Okay, yeah. Push, push a T, for sure. No, but you got to think about it. On some business side of things. Oh, yeah, Young Jeezy. The boys Jeezy, in the Jeezy, Jeezy. That money, that money split got to be crazy, man. Two chains, yeah. Two chains, right two chains. Right about that. Man, shit, you got to think, bro. This is probably them niggas. You know what I mean? Be four people in the group. One of them don't really got no talent, but he getting as equal pay as me. Like, nigga, look, I gave you that one album, nigga, but you ain't getting See, on the second I, album. Imagine being, imagine being a group of four niggas. Y'all got to split that, pay the management, pay the producers. And I'm the artist that's making all. Oh, no, I'm man. making all the beats. I'm writing all the songs. And you can barely sing, nigga. Nah. Yeah, you got to go. You got to go. <laughs> you got to go. That's Ain't no my, way around uh, that. That's how your boy, uh, 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 what's the nigga name? Ooh. RL did next. And next, he left them niggas. <laughs> RL left them niggas. RL hey. popped off solo too. Hey, but hey, but wouldn't you love to be one of them niggas in the back that just get the, uh, getting all the tours, knock down all the hoes. Said, fuck it. Uh, you don't got no solo parts. You feel me? Yeah. Fuck that it. Shit. That shit crazy. Reap all the benefits. Shit. As long as I know how to dance and nigga sang the hook. Hey, R.I.P. my nigga M Bone in Cali Swag District. He became part of the group. Used he to, didn't do no music. You used to do the Dougie? He was just doing the Dougie. I'm saying you. No, I ain't do no. You used to not hit the Dougie and shit? Nigga, I used to see you do it. Come on, bro. On every day. Stop it. You ain't never did the Dougie. I can't do the Dougie. You can? No. That was like a kid thing. That was your shit. Nigga, well, how was it my shit? I was your, you was a fucking jerking, nigga. What? You was jerking. I wasn't no jerk rapper. You was jerking. You said you used to go to school with a cereal backpack. I said clown a... dancing. Oh, same shit. No, it's not. My bad. And shout out to Tommy the Clown. He's on the shout caffeine Tommy nap. The clown on the He's caffeine on the nap. caffeine nap. You feel me? AD want to come on a caffeine nap. I mean, on your on your show, <laughs> and he want to clown dance. No, I can't. Hey, bro, I didn't make the gut back then. I don't think I'm gonna make it now. Hey, yo, Tommy the Clown, get this nigga on here, bro. Let's put some paint on this nigga face. Nigga, what was you doing back then? You know what I'm saying? What did you do back then? Like gang banging? No, nigga, I ain't talking about that. <laughs> I ain't talking about that. I wasn't doing no. We didn't have no fucking nigga. Dancing. Everybody had dances in the certain eras. In your era, when you was in high school, who had a dance out? Keep a G. Crip walking. That's what we was doing. Everybody was crip walking. I'm talking that's about. The, that's the dance. It was a. It was a nothing fun on the West Coast. That was fun. Not just crib walking. Bro, that was a huge movement. Bro. It was. It was. 